In this video, we'll show you how to set up the tools required to get started with MPLAB Harmony V3 and MCC. MPLAB Harmony is a fully integrated embedded software development framework supporting 32-bit MIPS and ARM Cortex-based MCU and MPU device families. To get started with development, we will first show you how to install the MPLABX IDE. Download the project from the web page and launch the installer. The version about to be installed is shown on the screen. Accept the agreement to continue the installation. The default installation directory is shown or it may be changed. Use system proxy settings is selected by default to allow access to internet. You may select no proxy for secure environment. Select the applications you want to install. The installer may be used to install MPLABX IDE and MPLAB IPE. Then select 32-bit MCUs and MPUs. Targeted device support installation would be quicker and consume less storage space. The status bar lets you see the progress of the installation. The MPLABX IDE will open on your PC and is ready to use. Now let us install the XE32 compiler. Go to Microsoft website and download the XE32 compiler installer for your operating system. Refer to the installation notes if you are using a Linux system. For Windows, unzip the downloaded file and run the installer. Launch the compiler installation executable. Click the Next button to continue. Accept the license agreement and click on Next. Choose the type of license you have purchased and click Next. Select the installation directory or keep the default location and click Next. Decide whether to add XC32 to the path environment variable, usually not required unless using from the command line and click next. Wait for the installer to unpack and install the necessary files. Once completed, you will see an installation complete screen. To verify that the installation was successful, you can check the compiler version by running xc32-gcc-version in the command prompt. Now that we have set up the MPLABX ID, and the XC32 compiler, let us set up the MPLAB code configurator and the Harmony content. In the 6.20 version of MPLABX IDE, the MPLAB code configurator 5.5.0 and the content manager 5.0.0 are installed by default. To verify the MCC plugin, go to Tools, Embedded and check if the MCC plugin is available. Next, go to Tools, Options, Plugins and select the Harmony repository as github.com slash Microship MPLAB Harmony. Specify the local folder for downloading the MPLAB Harmony packages or use the default location. To verify the content manager, click on the icon and launch the content manager. The content manager is common for classic, melody and harmony content. To download 32-bit Harmony content, click on the Content Type drop-down and select Harmony. You can use the drop-down menu to filter the content based on the device you are using for the application. You can select the required Harmony content packages and version and click on the Apply button to download it. Now let us understand how to use the MCC to create or open a Harmony project and download the Harmony content using the Content Manager. As an example, we will use the PIC32CMMC00 MCU. Open the kit page for the PIC32CMMC00 MCU shown on the screen. Download the zip file for the getting started demo project. Extract the demo firmware and open the project in MPLABX IDE. Go to Tools, Embedded and open MCC which will open the project graph. Before opening the project graph, the content manager will prompt you to download the mandatory content required for the 32-bit Harmony project and the content required for the Getting Started demo project. Click on Finish and download the mandatory content from the remote repository. Once the required Harmony content is downloaded, the project graph will open and now you can see the peripherals configured for this project. If you wish to add new libraries like Bluetooth, GFX or any other libraries, add the required peripheral block from the device resources and download the content from the Content Manager tab. With that, you are set to generate the Harmony code and continue your project development. Tooltip
In Content Manager, you can use the Load Manifest option to load the project manifest file and download the required Harmony content. The manifest file contains the tools and dependent package information using which the project in reference was created originally. You can check your local Harmony content using the Show Local Content option and update the content to the required version. Please visit microsoft.com slash harmony to learn more about MPLAB Harmony v3 features, benefits, demo applications and other information. We hope you enjoyed this Harmony and MCC setup information. Thanks for watching.